The shop is very big, and I'm not even sure if it's going to fit through the door. <laughs> Don't push, Robert. <laughs> this I'm way, Ben. Back a bit. Even. Back a bit, Stephen. Right. Oh. Right. 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 right a bit. Right, right a bit, Stephen. Oh, right. Oh. Now, right. Oh, steady, steady. Sorry. Oh, steady, Sorry. Stephen. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Just here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh, oh, neither do I, Moon. Oh. That was hard work, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, it was very heavy, this sideboard. Uh, Must be good solid wood, though. Uh, Kenny? Yeah? Are you out of breath? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, I hope you're not too out of breath to um, tell me a story, though. Oh, no, I don't think I am. <laughs> OK, yeah. where's the book? Yeah, here. Oh, yeah. I've chosen one already. Oh, good. That one, please. Oh, this one here, right there. <laughs> oh. Let me see. Robert the Boot was staying with his grandmother. Mm -hmm. Grimmel was staying there too. Grimmel is Robert's secret friend. No one but Robert can see or hear him. Even though Robert's grandmother couldn't see or hear Grimmel, she was very pleased that he had come to stay. After breakfast, everyone went up the wooden stairs to tidy the attic. <laughs> they looked in all the boxes and trunks and yeah. found an old wooden gramophone with a handle to wind it up and some records and a xylophone with some little wooden sticks to play it. Most interesting thing of all was a puppet made of wood. Oh. <laughs> it lay in the corner of the trunk with its strings tied round and round. When the strings had been untied, Robert's granny showed him how to, to make the puppet dance. It danced very slowly at first because the wooden joints were still stiff. But after a while, the dance got faster and faster. How the puppet leapt into the air. How it spun on the tips of its painted wooden shoes. How they danced over the creaking wooden floorboards of the attic. Oh, and on. back again. <laughs> Robert danced with a wooden puppet while Robert's grandmother held the strings. Take your partners and off you go. <laughs> Sashay around with an old C do, she sang. <laughs> thump, thump went Robert's shiny red boots and clickety clack went the puppet's wooden feet. Suddenly, in the middle of all the fun and music, Robert heard the sound of Grimm and sulking in the corner. Grimm always made a noise when he sulked so that everyone would know that he was in a bad mood. Robert stopped dancing and looked at him. What's the matter, he said. No one's dancing with me, said Grimmond. Everyone's dancing with him. Oh, Grimmond, said Robert. It's only a puppet. He lowered the puppet gently to the floor. The wooden head flopped down to the painted shoes and the wooden arms lay still. Grimmond watched for a moment, but the puppet didn't move again. He lifted one of the puppet's hands and it fell to the floor with a little clunk. Oh, it's made of wood, said Grimmond. I feel better now. Let's have some more music then, cried Robert. So Robert's grandmother put another record onto the gramophone and danced with Grimmond. Stamp, stamp, stamp went their feet over the dry old floorboards. Clunk, clunk, clunk went the wooden xylophone as Robert beat time with the little wooden sticks. <coughs> hey, hey, all those different things made out of wood. Mm, yeah, wood's very useful. Look at all the different things we've got in the shop that's made of wood. There's the, uh, there's the wardrobe. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And uh, the door. Oh, the door. Oh. Come in. <laughs> hey, there, there's that little wooden chair over there. Yeah. That's made of wood, yeah, isn't and, it? And the wooden clock case up there, you missed oh. that. Yeah, and the telephone. No, the telephone's oh. not made of wood. Oh. It's uh, it's hard plastic there. Oh. Knock it and see. Oh, all right. Knock, knock, knock. Oh, oh yes. Sounds Ooh. quite different. Hello, anybody there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, 
Yeah. Stephen's head isn't made of wood either. Funny, I always thought it was. No, <laughs> my head definitely isn't made of wood. <laughs> there are lots of wooden things, though, aren't there? Yeah, wood's very useful, and it's beautiful as well. Yeah. Yes, and this will look even better when it's polished. Ooh. And uh, the better it looks, the easier it is for you to sell. Yeah, I'll polish it, shall I, Stephen? I All like right. polishing things. <laughs> oh, I'm glad to hear that. Next time I come round, you can polish my car. It certainly mm. needs mm. it. You have to start it first. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Well, thanks for helping us with the sideboard, It Kenny. was my pleasure, yeah. uh, I think. Oh, <laughs> my back. Goodbye, That's Kenny. Goodbye. Thanks Open for the, the story. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, yeah, bye. Bye. <laughs> Robert. <laughs> ah, we'll soon have this looking as good as new. <laughs> and I'll help you. <laughs> Stephen, wood comes from trees, doesn't it? That's right. <laughs> but this sideboard's made of wood, but it doesn't look anything like a tree. No, no, it doesn't. No, the tree has to be cut down first, and then all sorts of different things are done to the wood before it's ready to be made into furniture. What sort of things? Well, we could find out. <laughs> With moon magic? Certainly. <laughs> Trees! Lots and lots of them! They're pine trees. And here's the man who's going to cut them down. He's a lumberjack. Hello, Jack! <laughs> mm, the trees are very tall, aren't they? How is he going to cut them down? He's got a power saw. He's trimming some of the bark off and the branches. That makes it easier for the tree to be dragged away. The tree looks different without its branches, doesn't it? Yes. Now we call it a log. Bye-bye, log! It's snowing. No, it's not. Well, what's happening then? You'll see. It's all the bark off the log. That's the machine that's stripping it. And when the bark's been taken off, all that's left is... Wood! That's right. <laughs> and then the wood can be made into furniture or doors or counters or anything at all. Would you believe it? <laughs> I wonder what sort of tree you were, Mr Sideboard. <laughs> an oak tree. Who said that? I did. I said I was an oak tree. <laughs> It was you, wasn't it, Stephen? Me? Sideboards can't speak. <laughs> no, they can't. <laughs> and they can't sing either. No. <laughs> but if they did, I know what sort of song they would sing. You want your guitar, don't you? Yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're never satisfied, are you, Stephen? <laughs> that oh. box is made of wood as well. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> now, if I was a sideboard, yeah. mm -hmm. this is the sort of song I would sing. Yeah. Once I was a tree mm -hmm. on a hilltop. Now I am a sideboard standing in your shop. I'm wood, ah! real wood. I'm wood, real wood. Hey! 
Hey, your guitar's made of wood as well. Yes. What would that sing? Uh, let me think. Hmm? Once I was a tree, tree. growing tall and strong. strong. Now I'm a guitar and I'm playing this song. Hey. I'm wood, real wood. I'm wood, real wood. <laughs> now, what other wooden things are there we could sing about? Um, what about the table in the back room? That's wooden. Yes, it is. So what are we waiting for? Yeah. Once I was a tree growing in the ground. <laughs> now I am a table that people sit around. I'm wood, real wood. I'm wood, real wood. Whee! <laughs> the old piano in the backyard. That's wooden too. Yes, it is. And we won't need the guitar for that song, will we? No. <laughs> Stephen, what sort of tree has yellow wood? Ah, the piano is made of wood, but it's been painted yellow. Oh. Lots of wooden things are painted. Oh. Now, um, once I was a tree, oh, was a tree. Growing, every day. growing every day. Now I am a piano, piano. that you sit and play. <laughs> I'm wood, real wood. Oh. I'm wood, real wood. Oh, no cats. Oh, I'm uh... Right, let's go and finish polishing the sideboard. Yes, but don't go hitting that too hard, will you? Come on. <laughs> ah, we'll soon have you shining bright, Mr. Sideboard. <laughs> What's the matter? Oh, don't some people treat furniture badly? Oh, what, dear. you mean the sort of people who bash pianos to pieces? No. I mean the sort of people who knock nails into sideboards. Oh, there are lots of little nail holes here well, and here. Mooncat, they're not nail holes. But well, what sort of holes are they then? They're holes made by woodworm. Woodworm? <laughs> What's a woodworm? It's a little grub that eats holes in wood. It eats wood? Yuck! <sighs> I like eating, but I don't think I'd like to eat wood. <laughs> Can you hear me, little worm? You ought to try rhubarb pie. It tastes much nicer than wood. Minka, <laughs> this is serious. Why? Well, if we leave the sideboard in the shop, yeah. the woodworm can start eating all the other wooden things in here. Oh. Like the furniture, oh. the counter, the clock. <laughs> and the door, and the floorboards, and your guitar. <laughs> yes. I'd better get this sideboard out into the yard until oh. I decide what to do with oh. it. Leave it to me, Stephen. No, 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 no. no it... I can manage. It's too heavy for you. Yes, but... Uh... No, if you try to lift it, you'll hurt yourself. Oh, <laughs> oh it's Kenny. Oh. Hello. <laughs> Car won't start. Can I use the phone to phone the garage? Right. Yes. Has your car got woodworm, Kenny? No, cars don't get woodworm, Toby. <laughs> it's, uh, it's wood that gets woodworm. Cars you're, are metal. You're oh. just in time, Kenny. Just in time for what? Well, to help me carry the sideboard out into the yard. Oh, no. After all the trouble we had getting it in. You haven't sold it already, have you? <laughs> That's a joke. Stephen never sells anything. <laughs> no, no. The, the sideboard's got woodworm. Oh. We have to carry it out. Yeah. Uh, all right, then. I'll make the uh, call later. Oh, thanks, Kenny. Um, I can help. No, no, no. It's too heavy for you, Mooncat. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you worry, Mooncat. We'll help. do it. We'll lift it. Oh, I think... Yes. Oh. I'm a bit... All right. Right. Get over it. Yeah. All right. Oh, oh, I'm stuck. No, oh, I'd better help whether you want me to or not. Where's that gone? It's in the yard. Everybody seems to have forgotten moon magic. Oh, do you mean to tell me we struggled to get it into the shop, struggled to get it out again, and you could have done the job as easily as that? Yes, I offered to help, but Stephen wouldn't let me. Oh, Stephen. Oh, sorry. Oh, my... Back. Oh, come on, let's sing. If I was a worm eating through the wood in and out the holes, wouldn't it be good? No, it wouldn't be good, Kenny. It would be for the worm. Oh, oh yes. It would. It would be good. Oh, yes. It would. It would be good. Oh, yes. Oh, stop it. it. Finished. <laughs> oh, me back. <laughs> <laughs>